gosh, I think it must have been back in the late 70s, I had lived in a home in Terra Linda, California, an Eichler home, which is all um, walls of glass and open beam ceilings, very simply built. And they all had radiant heat floors. And that was really my first um, experience living in it and having that in the wintertime. So it was, um, I really loved the way the heat was all even and, you know, silent and no dust and the whole thing. So that is something that um, I just started, um, you know, designing into all the buildings when I went out on my own. Um, when I was in the architecture and planning firm, we did it, you know, when we built homes up in Lake Tahoe and um, Park City, Utah. Um, they were all, they're already in heat. Um, it was a much colder climate. Um, but all the homes I built, all the, almost all the new ones um, have that whole option in it. It's just, you know, very healthy. You don't have all the dust and everything blowing around and and um, pollutants and it was nice for the dogs and the um, running in and out in the winter time with all the rain the floor dried <laughs> and um, then you just dusted it off I mean whether they came in with muddy feet it didn't matter it'd be dry it a little bit and you would just use a dust mop and, or a vacuum and vacuum it right up so um, maintenance wise but um, it's just a different type of heat um, all your forced air, um, you figure your old thermostats are about four feet. And um, so everything, if it's set for 70, everything above it is 70, and everything below it is cooler. Um, so the difference is, is that the heat's coming from under your feet, and so you can set the temperature less, and um, it's more, it's even. You don't have any cold spots. So if, let's say you had walls of glass at the it would just be an even heat through the entire place. And we've gotten a little bit more sophisticated with it. Um, I have it under, you know, all the shower, all the shower floors are, you know, the same radiant heat in them. Um, in the summertime, the floor's cooler. So, um, and then again, you know, the cool air, you know, stays down closer to the floor. Um, so, you know, it's just, it just seems to me that it's more energy efficient that way. Cooler when you want it in the summer and, um, you know, really warm and, and nice in the winter, cozy.